two-man plane. <coughs> Let me start that again. It's a two-man play, uh, Easy Twinsy. It's running at the Pop Art Theatre in Johannesburg next month. The production won an accolade at the Market Theatre Laboratories Zwakala Festival last year. Now, the story is basically around the Rates 4 incident in 2007. You remember it? Where four white males at the University of the Free State humiliated a group of black workers. To tell us more, we're joined in studio by <coughs> the director of the play, Lotando Mgomezulu and Longani Mabaso. Good to have both of you. Welcome to the program. Yeah, thank Good you. Thank you. Uh, it's an absolute yeah. pleasure. It's a very sensitive, sensitive story. It, it really, is. It really is. is. I mean, that got South Africa speaking we were appalled by what we saw um, and you've decided to make a play about it just yes. talk to me about why why you wanted to do this so we wanted to to to, to explain the our take on it our take on it so we we did with our writer we did it in terms of the show the show and and how it happened we, we took our take and our take was um, on what would happen to us. So we saw this as this is not just those people there, it is also our mothers. So we wanted to speak as, as the children of the nation. This is, these are the mothers of the nation. So we wanted to speak as the children and we wanted to, 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 to have our view because Ulunga uh, Mabaso and Rusipo Zawe play the sons of one of the mother who was involved in the incident. So this, this, this is their take and this is their truth and what it means as a country and, and as people, as descendants of that. Yeah, yeah. Now, you, you play, what, what is the character that you play in this? Um, I'm playing Muzi. Yeah. Um, he's the older brother. Mm. Um, and then, of course, him being the older brother, I think he, he feels the more pressure of, of trying to restore the dignity in the family, um, trying to bring back the family name. And... He's just a character that really, he, he, I could say he, he's not really friendly when it comes to white people. <laughs> he doesn't really like them yeah. in the play. So it's his take on how things unfolded and what happened in the incident. Yeah, yeah. Mm. I mean, remind us of this incident because, you know, we're going back to 2007. <laughs> it's an incident we, we remember vividly, but, you know, mm. a lot of people may have forgotten it. I mean, talk to us about the storyline of the play. So in 2007, a group of uh, four male white students at the University of Free States, decided to, to do a, a video yeah. and post it on YouTube. This video was about their own take of integration. So in this video, they, they went to, to the staff cleaners. So it was, four, it was four female cleaners and one male. So these cleaners were made to, do, to perform athletics tasks, yeah. to, 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 to dance to Afrikaans music, to drink alcohol, to play rugby and the most gruesome one was that they had to 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 play a game of fear factor yeah. which they made they made something which was mixed with garlic it was mixed with protein powder and it was mixed with human urine yeah and they were made to eat this and in the video you see them puking it out you mm. see you see you see what it felt and and then at the end of the day they said no this is our take of integration and then afterwards and afterwards they they went to trial they were given a fine a mere, a mere fine of 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 20,000 rand and the way they go hmm. and that's i mean that was this is what the story is all about so mm, yes. it's it's uncomfortable watching i imagine what's the the reaction been from audiences i think i think i think the way we've tried to tell it is just to go about it very truthfully mm. um we haven't really sugar-coated anything or or maybe said stuff that wasn't there initially you told it like we it, like it, was. <laughs> it is. so yeah. so for people that are very sensitive some of them will shy away from it but we don't try to 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 get people to not come and watch the show it's yeah. very educational at the end of the day mm. because like we say it's a take of these two brothers and how this incident has affected them and how they live their lives mm. yeah. so so basically we it's very truthful it's 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 mm. proper proper truth you get onto the stage, you are playing this character, you are mm. reliving events, Longani. What mm. is it like for you, I mean, to be put into a situation like that? And you are, you're an actor. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you know, like you say, I think, I think most important about acting, we have to educate people as much as we entertain. So for me, when I go on stage and doing a character like that, it, it, it puts on so much pressure on me first because I'm African. 
I think the story touches very um, deeply to, to my roots and yeah. where I come from. And, and what I try and do every time when I'm, when I'm on the stage is to just give people an honest reaction of what it would be like if we are really, really were one of the sons. So for me, it's just about truth. And yeah. once the truth comes out, it's, it's a beautiful thing to watch. Just, uh, we're running out of time, unfortunately, but just why, why only these two characters? Uh, from a directorial point yes. of view, why did you choose these two characters? These two characters. The, the, main, the main reason I did not cast a female older woman to play the mother yeah. was I wanted, to be, I wanted it to be t truthful. It, 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 it was, we, we have a voiceover of the mother and we have shadows of the mother. But I, did, I, 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 I couldn't get someone to, to, to do it because it would have desensitized it. It would have made it less than what it was. Yeah. So the mother plays an overarching idea and it becomes a through line of action. And we, we actually have a, a, a clip of the mother of the Ritz 4 incident. So you get the chance to actually see the mother and, 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 and feel her yeah. more than her being played by an actor. Excellent. So I wanted to remain truthful to that. Amazing. Mm. When is it on? I'm coming. <laughs> when, what, it's, so it's on, I, I know it's already shown, but it's going to be at the Pop Art Theatre? It's going to be at the Pop the Art Theatre from the 16th to the 19th. 16th to the 19th yeah, so of February. 16th, 17th and 18th, it's at 8pm. Yeah. And then on the 19th of February, on the Sunday, it's at 3.30. 3.30 in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Can't wait. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I think it's fantastic. It's a moment in our history that we wish we could get rid of, but these moments, I suppose, are what make us. Who they we make are. us who we are. Forward. They make us yeah. who we are. Guys, thank you. Thank you well, so much for being with us. Lutando, of course, is the director of it. Lungani is one of the, the actors in it, and I'm looking forward to seeing it. 16th to the 19th of Feb, Pop Art Theatre uh, in uh, Johannesburg at the Market Theatre. Uh, guys, I'm sure you've heard about this, uh, this whole uh, Grace Bible Church issue with the mm. homosexuals. Yes, 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 ah, yes, yes, have yes. a look at some of the tweets. <laughs> I just want to quickly say goodbye on these tweets here. So we'll put them up on the screen. Let's look at them. Let's see what you see.